garden is where we grow a lot of the edibles, so fruits and vegetables and herbs. And it's basically been created to show people what they can do in their gardens. There is a lot of science involved in kitchen gardening. We are in a changing climate, so it is going to change what we can grow and some of our staples are going to have to change. Kitchen gardens are really important places, especially public ones, because we can try out new crops that help us with our food security for the future. And I'm learning a lot about the crops and what they will take, and it's just about staying ahead of that and being as flexible as possible so that I can try and really produce the best food that I can. We'll start on things like broad beans and peas, which come through the end of May. In the middle of summer, you get potatoes, carrots, you get beetroot, lots of root crops start coming around then. When the tomatoes start ripening, your pumpkins are ready to harvest. We make a big display of them so people can really see that and really come along and enjoy this time of year. Our fruit and vegetables are harvested and quite a lot of them go to the restaurant on site and get made into beautifully delicious meals. And the staff also take a little bit since you have to taste what you're growing. So I'm hoping when the public visit this kitchen garden, they get inspired and I just really hope they go home and have a go.